I have no idea what that what that is advertising. Hookups equal dot org. Visit dot org to hook up today. Well. <laughs> is so different from when I was on Wall Street. First of all, you might notice I'm actually sitting at my breakfast table as opposed to what I used to do, which is, oh my gosh, we have to get up because the meeting started at seven um, and they went meeting after meeting after meeting after meeting after meeting after meeting all day long through to dinner. You know, as an entrepreneur, don't worry, I, I actually get up earlier. I wake up at 4.30, 4 o'clock. If I'm in one of my insomnia cycles, 3 or 3.30 in the morning, I get up, I come into this kitchen, um, and I, I get into the day more slowly. I really try to think, and I find there's a burst of creativity in the morning and a burst of ideas in the morning. And so the, the team knows they get in the morning and they've got, you know, if it's, if it's a good day, no slacks from me. Um, if it's a normal day, a couple slacks from me. And if it happens to be a particularly productive day, whoosh, you know, they come in to be met by, oh, I just woke up. I think the most feared words at LFS these days are, I woke up thinking. Hi. Hi. I'm uh, on my way to work. That's cool. Yeah. It's my daughter on her way oh. to get a juice. There you go. You're famous. <laughs> The commute for me is the transition period. It's personal because you're checking out Instagram and maybe FaceTiming with one of the kids, but then it's also you want to know what's going on before you walk into the office. The topic of money just comes wrapped up in so much emotion and particularly all the messages society gives us women about money, not supposed to talk about it. Women's magazines can, you know, whoa, what's your money type? Are you a Miranda or a Carrie? So they can be infantilizing when it comes to money. And so as I'm headed to work and looking at social and particularly Instagram, you know, culture and pop culture and what's going on in news is informing us because you can't be representing women, money and power in this environment today and sort of say, you know what, I'm sitting out what's going on. So here we are at the Elevest Worldwide Headquarters. We only have one office. Usually when I get here in the morning, the first thing I do is I have to turn off the alarm and turn on the lights because when I go through my insomnia, I am always the first one here. But we're late today because I brought you to work with me. Uh, my desk is at the very end there, which is a long way from the office I used to have. At one point, my co-founder tried to encourage me to have half a desk. Um, and I said, you know, I lost the big office. I think I get to keep a whole desk. Um, so I won that battle. Part of why I wake up so darn early in the morning is because there's actually a gender investing gap. Women don't invest as much as men do, and it costs some women hundreds of thousands, even millions of dollars over the course of their lives. Uh, but you can see around me here, the team is in and ready to work to close a gap that most people don't even know exist. Okay, good morning. Hi. natural. <laughs> <laughs>